another visit from the Biden administration. First Lady Jill Biden is making a stop here in Albuquerque today. This comes just weeks after a visit from the nation's second gentleman. News 13's Madison Connor is here with the details of her three-day visit to the Southwest. Good morning, Madison. Good morning, Crystal. New Mexico continues making headlines on how we've handled the COVID-19 pandemic, and now the state is one of the few in the country on top when it comes to vaccinations, and that is catching the attention of the Biden administration. But I think anytime, you know, New Mexicans get an opportunity to be on the top of these lists, so to speak, when we're used to unfortunately being somewhere near the bottom, I think it's an opportunity for us to shine. The First Lady will land at the Sunport this afternoon before meeting up with Governor Michelle Luan Grisham. Together, they will visit the First Choice Community Health Care Facility in the South Valley. KRQE political expert Gabe Sanchez believes that this will give them time to highlight our success and help other states follow. New Mexicans should be proud because anytime somebody of that stature representing the President of the United States uh, makes a stop in your community, it's indicative of the importance, I think, of, of what we're doing here in the context of COVID. Now, once the First Lady leaves Albuquerque, she'll continue in the Southwest into Window Rock, Arizona, meeting with the First Lady of the Navajo Nation. Navajo Nation President Jonathan Nez believes that this visit will highlight the lack of resources in the area and create more funding in the future. Crystal, back to you. Thanks for breaking that down for us this morning, Madison. Now, throughout the pandemic, the Navajo Nation has been one of the hardest hit areas by COVID-19. The Navajo Nation president hopes this will spark a visit from President Biden himself.